today we are talking about power-ups in Trello. Now, anyone who knows me knows that I love power-ups in Trello and it is because they save a phenomenal amount of time. Like we are all busy business owners and we normally are juggling like our business with life and kids and everything like school commitments and assemblies and there's so much going on. So the power up that I want to show you today, it's one of my personal favorites. It is called the card repeater. So the card repeater is perfect for anything which is a scheduled repeated task. It might be your morning to-do list of like the things that you have to do every single morning. You can set that to repeat. It might be something that you have to do on a once monthly basis, things like that. So I'm going to show you how to set it up. It's really easy and I think you're going to love it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to go over to is the menu. Click show menu. Now this power up section is here. If you click this, what that does is take you to all of the power ups that are available in Trello and there are heaps. I definitely remember, uh, I definitely recommend you guys deep diving into these and finding ones which are great and going to work for your business specifically. But today we're just going to be looking at the card repeater and I'm going to add that. You can see it appears just there. Now we are now ready to add our first repeater card. So it's really easy. You just do it like a normal card. Go add card. I'm going to go repeated card just here. Beautiful. And that is, as I said, just a normal card. You click on it and this is where the magic happens. So you click repeat and it gives you all these options for how you want the card repeated. So you might have your to-do lists in under the description. You might have wording, you might have content. I don't know what you want to put there, but yeah, you can set it up so that it's going to work for your business. So you can set when it repeats, you can go weekly, monthly, yearly. I'm going to go weekly. You can set the time that it repeats as well. So you might want it to repeat before you even start work. So it's waiting for you when you start work. I am going to set mine to be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. It's going to happen every week. The list that it is going to appear under is going to be Monday for me. I'm going to put it on Monday and I'm going to set it to go to the top of the list, but you can choose the bottom if you want. It depends how you've got your cards arranged. So I'm going to set that up. Beautiful. And as you can say, see, the next repeat is going to happen on this date at this time. So at that time on that date it is going to add a new card identical to the one that we created on the Monday that you can then use to do whatever you want with you can add your notes to it you can mark it off you can use it as a to-do list it's fantastic so yeah I this is something that I use on a daily basis I use it to actually project manage my team as well I set up tasks which are repeated which trigger emails it can be quite you can set it up to be quite complicated or you can just use it simply I hope this helps though and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you get in there and set up a card repeater for yourself because it'll change your life. It's amazing.